In this video, I'm showing you how to uninstall VirtualBox in Windows 10. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and hit that subscribe button. And once you've done that, please go and consider leaving a like as well, as I really do appreciate it and it helps out the channel. And please do watch this guide right until the end so I know all of the full steps and the tips and tricks of being able to go and finish off uninstalling VirtualBox. So the first thing you want to do is simply come to your Windows desktop just like so, and you want to come to the bottom left where you've got your Windows logo. So click on the start button, and then all you want to do is go one up to where you've got settings. Then click on settings, and it's gonna take you here. So as you can see, we've got a ton of options. All you want to do is simply go in here, is go and type uninstall just like so, and then it's gonna take you to add or remove programs. Now do keep watching as things can get a bit complicated here. So there are two things you may need to search for. Either go and search for VirtualBox, of course, just like so, so search for VirtualBox. And if you can't find VirtualBox, you need to go and search for something called LD Player. So I'm gonna go and test this out. So we're gonna search for VirtualBox. As you can see, I do have it here, but if you didn't have VirtualBox and all you need to do is search for LD Player. And guys, I wanna quickly come in here just to say at the end of the video, I'm showing another alternative of uninstalling VirtualBox. So do keep watching and that's gonna go and find it. I'm not sure why, but I've just heard some people have that issue there. So then what you want to do is go and search for VirtualBox just like so. You want to go and click on it once. So go and click uninstall and then go and click uninstall again. And then you're gonna have this pop-up here saying preparing to remove. We may go and get a Windows security pop-up in a minute. So I just had the pop-up there. Unfortunately, my screen recorder doesn't record it. It's gonna mostly do its own thing. And there we go, it's actually just disappeared. And if we go and search for VirtualBox, it's not there. And once it has disappeared, that means it is fully finished and you're all ready to go and reinstall it if you want to, or you can just go and not download it again. So if the usual way of uninstalling VirtualBox isn't working, then all you want to do is simply go to your file explorer, just like so, I've opened up mine here. And what you want to do is come to this PC, and then you want to go to local disk, and then you want to go to programs or your programs file with x86. So I'm gonna try this one here. You wanna come into here and check for any folder called VirtualBox or Oracle VirtualBox, something like that, and you can go and remove that there. You can also go and check the other folder as well. I've just uninstalled it, so mine's not gonna be in here, but you may see the folder and you can just go and delete that directly, um, and then you can try and reinstall VirtualBox again, or just leave it. If you found this guide useful, please go down below and hit the subscribe button, leave a like for more. I look forward to catch you in the next one. Peace.